Well, I'm going to keep working on the Zenith. I was encouraged by uh, two YouTubers, Radio Fixer and Radio Wild, uh, to keep going on this from uh, comments they'd made. And, uh, I believe I found one of the problems. It's right now, it's, it's just dead. And if you hit this wire, you hear it crackling back to life. And that goes to the second IF, so I'm going to have to take the IF can apart and look for a short. This That could be the whole problem. Yeah, now that the IF can is taken apart, now it works perfect. It won't stop playing. There's the brown wire that was I was pushing on. There's no, no apparent shorts, so I'm not Real understanding may have the opposite way of the wire. Maybe it's shorting out on the chassis. Take a look. I think another problem. I think the can is hitting uh, one of the uh, wires that I'd soldered in. And you can see, and it's shorting out on the solder points. I think this that might be the problem. Well, I fixed the uh, shorting problem with this wire. The wire is fine. Uh, what it was was when you moved the wire. One of the solder points was hitting the side of the can and shorting out. That's why it was sort of intermittent. When you jiggled the wire, the whole IF moved. So I'm back where I start. I'm back where I started. I'm back to receiving our Spanish station, and that's about it. But at least it plays. Uh, it's going to take a lot more uh, figuring to see why it doesn't work like it should. I'm just going through and trying to hit on anything, see if any loose connections or shorted wire or anything, but I think this is, I've always had a problem with the electrolytics with one having low voltage. I think it's this big mess I made down here with these wires. It was just to replace one for another with different wires, but I think I screwed something up because everything else seems right. This just looks like a big mess. Uh, maybe that'll be in the next video. I'll try tearing this apart to see what I can do. All right, thanks for watching. All right, bye.